So here we see some large uh, varicosities again, which are suitable for phlebectomy, coming down into the uh, ankle. Once again, these are coming from the great saphenous vein that's incompetent, which we'll be treating with endovenous thermoablation. But these are best treated by phlebectomy. They're far too large for foam sclerotherapy. And at the moment, there's nothing else really that works particularly well for these. Uh, Trivix could be used in some centers for them, but at the moment, we're still a little uh, worried about whether the cost effectiveness for that, but that is something um, for discussion with uh, research in the future. So marking these once again, the patient's been standing up for at least uh, a couple of minutes. We can feel these veins nice and tense, and then we just mark around with a permanent e ink marker so that when the patient's lying down and they disappear, we'll still be able to see them. And once again, we go around the outsides so we can get an impression of where the vein is running when we actually have the patient lying down and the vein is invisible and non-palpable. Now just turn your leg a little bit that way. That's lovely, thank you. So at this point we can see this is the extent of the varicosities, but of course we know there are uh, non-varicose tributaries going everywhere, so we'll be coming back to finish off the small intermediate bits with the uh, foam sclerotherapy in the future. And we're just going to also take away these little varicosities down, or rather large varicosities down, by the ankle. And that's all ready to go now.